Hi you guys, welcome to another Mean Mug and Monday. This week I have a mug from World Market. It kind of reminded me of a bathtub. It was kind of fun and cute, so why not? So that's my mug this week. What is the one thing that I do every single day to make sure that our lives are set up for the next day? Make sure you like and subscribe, hit the little notification button so that you know when videos come out every Monday and Thursday. There's one thing that we do that really kind of changes how our lives run. Well, that one thing is that we clean up at the end of every single day. I don't just mean like put your shoes over, you know, on the side or anything. I mean, we literally clean up the house at the end of every single day, especially in the common areas. Now your bedroom, we all have things that sit out in our bedroom for a little while, but as far as the common areas, the kitchen, the dining room, breakfast room, living room, the other living room because uh, my kid has one upstairs all of the common areas are picked up there's no stuff left out overnight there's nothing that i can trip over on my way to go get a glass of water in the middle of the night and it really makes it so that the next morning when you wake up you get up you walk out into the living room into the kitchen to go make some coffee and everything is put away it's not like you're bombarded buy things in every single direction going, oh, I need to pick that up and oh, I need to pick that up because people really don't realize how much time we spend cleaning up and picking up those little things that get left out every single day. So, you know, every day we do the dishes, my husband puts the dishes into the dishwasher and my daughter and I put everything away. Um, I wipe down all of the counters so that there isn't food left out overnight. There's little things like that that they really, really pile up day after day after day. So whether you start to adopt this every single day instantaneously, whether you do this once a week, whether you start doing it every other day, you'll really start to reap the benefits of being able to wake up in the morning and come out and you don't have that stress automatically when you wake up because the house is already kind of picked up. Things are put away. You're able to think more clearly. When you look at your plan for the day, you don't have to factor in all that time of tidying up and picking up constantly. It really sets you up for a nice, good day. And a lot of people don't realize how much time is spent cleaning up and picking up. And this especially goes as a shout out to the stay at home moms because nobody really realizes how much time they spend putting things back where they belong if you've got little ones or anything have baskets and buckets and all that kind of stuff so that things can kind of be put away now if you have tiny ones where you've got you know the play area and the play mats and stuff like that you're not going to be putting up their little pack and play every single day. That's gonna stay out there. If you've got the little mats on the floor that they play with that have the toys over it, that's probably gonna stay. If you have dogs and things like that and you don't want the dogs playing on the mat that's on the floor, maybe pick it up and stick it in the pack and play so that the dog can't get to it. So little things like that of putting things away because then also, even especially with kids, it makes it so that when it's out of their sight, they actually have to pull it out. And so it's kind of like they get reinterested in things because they have to actually seek it out to play with it again. Things that stay out all the time, everybody doesn't notice them. They just, it, they slowly build up all around you. But if you put things away, you can actually appreciate them a lot more when you need to take them out. So you've got cleaner lines, you have horizontal surfaces that don't have a bunch of things on. This goes for your desk as well, especially if you have an at-home office. Make sure that you're picking up and cleaning off your desk at the end of the day. You shouldn't have a bunch of junk sitting on the top of it. That way you can actually focus and have space to work. So that is our one main thing that we do every single day. We pick up, we put everything away, everybody pitches in because it's not just my house. Everybody lives here. I know I'm the mom, but everybody contributes to the little things sitting around. So we all help pick up and put everything away at the end of the day. Make sure that you put all of your comments in the comment section. I would love to see what you guys do to keep your house nice, picked up, and tidy. How often do you do it? Who all pitches in? How old are your kids if you've got little ones running around that you kind of have to worry about with their things too? So let me know. I look forward to talking to you guys uh, later this week. I'll be coming back on Thursday for another video. Y'all have fun.